Hi, I'm Constance Zimmer from Unreal, and welcome to the October issue of Good Housekeeping Magazine. We are in Harlem, New York, and we are taking a tour of some of the most iconic or the most talked about places in Harlem. So I, I have felt like I've been from New York my whole life, even though I was born in Seattle. My daughter was raised here like zero to five. We came back to New York every six to eight weeks and tried to show her all the cultures and the food and the people. And it's, it's one of my favorite places. I want to come back and live here full time. I really like the smiling poop. I really like it. I think it's supposed to be ice cream, but it's not ice cream. It's not in a cone. It's a smiling poop. It's a smiling turd. Sorry, it makes me laugh. <laughs> That's why I like it. <laughs> the other day I was giving my daughter cartwheel lessons and all of my friends were looking at me like, how do you still know how to do a perfect cartwheel? And I said, it's like riding a bike. For fall, I think must have pieces are a very good trench for light rain and for cold. So like light rain, you wanna have a good khaki trench that I think goes with anything. And then I'm a big fan of like a nice cashmere navy blue trench. Not too long though. It's gotta be like just below the knee so you can kind of wear jeans and sneakers, but dress it up. I tend to shop a lot online because I'm always so busy. So I really actually go to magazines a lot and find like, oh, look at that. That's a great trench or whatever. I go by a lot of recommendations, people who I trust and I respect and what they're wearing and if they have a similar body type to me. So the way that Quinn dresses this season on Unreal, I wanted her to be this very, very confident woman in like super feminine tight dresses with heels. You know, it's about I'm a woman. I'm not ashamed to be a woman. Just because I might be doing a man's job, I would like to even look more like a woman and prove that I can do that plus be in heels and tight clothes. It's fun. <laughs> you know, I have no idea why I get cast as these kind of very rough, unfiltered, mean women, but I've always asked my directors and they always say to me, well, it's because you're not like that in real life. I do, they do allow me to improvise a little bit with Quinn, especially when I'm in front of the monitors and I'm yelling at the contestants or yelling at the host. It's hard though, because when I do improv, I feel like they take it personally because they, and I'm like, but it's not Constance. Constance isn't making up the lines, it's Quinn making up the lines within the scene. So, um, but I do find myself apologizing a lot to a lot of the cast. I'm pretty sure that if I was a character on Everlasting, I would probably be the, like the flirt, and I'd be like the, the class clown. I'd be like the goofball, that everyone would be like, oh, throw Constance over there, she'll, she'll prat fall into anything. That would be me. I'd be that one, which is embarrassing. <laughs>